Whether you pride yourself as being the next Martha Stewart or cook out of necessity, you're in the kitchen a lot. In the middle of making a meal, the last thing you want is to search for something while bacon is burning on a pan. Welcome to Jensen's DIY, and here are 26 super smart ways to keep your kitchen organized. 1. When you are looking to make a big meal in the beginning of the week to eat throughout the week, it helps to have everything set out to store this food. This is why bag racks are such a good idea. With bag racks, you can line up sealed bags to dump all of the food in and quickly and efficiently meal prep. This keeps everything neat and organized. 2. What is the point of even trying to keep a kitchen organized if you're always getting your hands dirty? There's no need to have pruning fingers when you invest in a dish squeegee. This tool will help scrape food off plates after meals and clean up any nasty particles that build up in the sink. 3. This may seem like a pretty simple organizational suggestion, but it is also a simple solution for something that often gets messed up in the kitchen. Hasn't it ever happened where you go to take the dishes out of the dishwasher, thinking they're clean, and by the time you've put most of them away, you realize the batch was actually dirty? Eliminate this hassle by putting a magnet on the door that signifies whether the dishes are clean or dirty. 4. These magnetic stackable measuring spoons remain organized against each other when you are not using them. They can be stored easily and won't get lost since they are magnetic. You will then be able to pull whichever one you need away from the stack and use it for whatever tasty meal you are making. 5. Don't keep your cutting boards out in the open where they are messily stacked up and in the way. Instead, invest in an over-the-cabinet holder for these boards that you can put over the cabinet door under your sink in your kitchen. You will keep your cutting boards out of the way, in a nice and neat way, to be easily accessed whenever you need them. 6. When you're trying to keep your kitchen neat and organized, it pays to have extra space. With multiple shelves, a corner rack shelf can stay out of the way and store multiple items. This is a great way to keep your kitchen organized while adding a little bit of style to your kitchen. 7. Just like a corner rack shelf that can store spices or other little trinkets in the kitchen, a cabinet counter tier helps stack your plates. Keeping everything organized, they also make sure everything is stacked neatly. They keep all of the plates clean and make them easy for you to take one day out when you're needing it. 8. When you're cooking, food sometimes falls through the cracks. Not only does this make everything messy, but can also attract bugs. You don't want to have any infestation that will make everything harder. This is why stove gap covers are perfect for keeping your kitchen cleaner and avoiding any messes. 9. We all have a collection of plastic bags that we collect from supermarkets and stuff into the cabinets under the sink. We either stuff them all in a bigger bag or just leave them loose under the sink. With the plastic bag holder, you can neatly store all of those plastic bags and be able to easily pull one out at a time. 10. When you are trying to organize your spice jars, you don't want to stuff them in your cabinet. This will take up a lot of room and be hard to tell what kind of spices you have stored away. Instead, use magnetic spice jars in order to press against your fridge. This will store them out of the cabinets and have them nicely displayed on your fridge. 11. Don't you hate it when you are looking for your plastic storage containers to put leftovers in, but you can't find which lid matches which bottom? With an organizer, you can easily store the lids and containers so you know where everything is at all times. 12. Personally, I love the idea of kitchen carts. Not only do they look chic in your kitchen, but are incredibly functional. They can easily store pots, pans, plates, and everything else in between. If you don't have enough storage units in your kitchen, a cart is a perfect means of storing items in your kitchen. 13. Haven't you ever wondered how to store a half of a lemon without it going bad? Plastic bags don't work and neither does aluminum foil. That is where these cute little food huggers come into play. You can not only keep tomatoes, lemons, and fresher, but you can also cover jars that you lost the lids for. 14. 
Your hand towels are a necessity in your kitchen for wiping down the counter, your hands, and more. Where do you put them, though? You don't want to simple toss the hand towels aside. Instead, you want to neatly hang them. That's where a kitchen towel bar comes into place to nicely display your hand towels. 15. A colander is a kitchen essential. You can rinse vegetables, drain pasta, and more when you use a colander. The problem is, they do take up space in your kitchen, not when you use a collapsible colander. You can get one in any color you want and be able to store it easily when it's not in use. It still functions like a metal colander, but takes up less space. 16. Why do you need to buy a bunch of pots and pans when you can cook everything you need in one pot? An instant pot comes in handy when you are wanting to make homemade meals. You can brown meat, make a lovely stew and more when it comes to an instant pot. 17. You can use any part of your kitchen, even the front fake drawers in your kitchen. Make them into little drawers for your sponges so they aren't sitting on top of the sink sloppily. This is a neat little decision to make in order to store your sponges and make everything in your kitchen neat. 18. Whiteboards are not just for teachers in the classroom. Instead, they can also be used to keep your plans together with a magnetic whiteboard on the fridge. You can write your grocery list, your dinner recipe, and even chores for the week that your kids need to do. 19. You don't want to put a sponge on the kitchen counter. That is not sanitary. Keep your sponge away from the kitchen counter with a cute little sponge display. You'll not only add a little pop to your kitchen, but you will also be able to store a necessary kitchen item neatly. 20. When you use airtight storage pop containers, you can store food for longer so that they remain fresh. You can also provide a neater storage method to your kitchen's layout when you use these types of containers. When you use one of these containers, you can store food for longer and you avoid the risk of bugs. 21. Turn dead space in your kitchen cabinets into a way to store pots and pans when you use a kitchen cookware organizer. Don't simply throw the lids and pots in a cabinet when you can use something like this nifty organizer. 22. It's a pain sometimes to store food containers. They can be tossed around in a cabinet and become a real mess. Has it ever happened to you when you open a cabinet and all of these lids come flying out? You don't want that. Instead, purchase stackable food containers so you can pack everything away in an organized fashion. 23. Everyone loves fresh fruit, but there's not always a good way to store them. You can buy one specifically for your fruit so you can hang your bananas and store the rest of your fruit. You can display them nicely on top of a kitchen table for guests to see when they are coming over. 24. A lazy Susan isn't just something to have on a table to share your food with others. It's a great way to store pots and pans in a corner cabinet. Use a Lazy Susan to store your kitchen essentials while also having them readily available for whenever you need them. A Lazy Susan looks great and functions well for your cooking needs. 25. Now this is a cool tool. You know how you need a bunch of different items for different things around the kitchen? If you have a small kitchen, space is incredibly valuable. This is why an 8-in-1 kitchen cabinet is a good purchase. You can still zest your lemons, squeeze orange juice, and measure your liquids and spices with this gadget. 26. Coffee makers are nice to have in the home, but they take up a lot of counter space. As nice as it is to have a fresh cup of coffee in the morning, you could use that space for something else. A French press is small, takes up little space, and makes an amazing cup of coffee. Have a great cup of joe every time you make yourself one with a French press. And that's all for now. What do you think about this episode? Please share your thoughts about this video in the comment section. For more decorating and organizing ideas, stay tuned to our channel. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.